Welcome back to my channel and if you are new here welcome hopefully you consider subscribing to the frugal j family hit that notification bell so you can notify every time this girl brings you a video and don't forget to please give me a thumbs up it really helps out my channel today i'm wearing in pink for the cure because it's the month of october and it is breast awareness month very very important to me and my family and my husband and i've been working on something that i want to share with you guys today in this video and I do have some notes because I don't want to forget anything, okay? I want to share everything with you guys because if you guys, obviously everybody knows about breast cancer and this is just a very touchy um, subject, but I know that many of us either lost someone, either a close family member or a friend. Um, it could be very scary. It's a horrible thing. Um, many, many women have fought this ugly disease and they don't all have been blessed to come out of it. And so being that it is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, I really wanted to do something to help out this cause. So I too had a big scare back in the early, um, I don't know, I think it was 2006, 2007, I want to say. I had a big scare where I found a lump myself and um, I panicked. I panicked. I went to the emergency room and nothing was able to be done for me in the emergency room. And this thing was huge. And I always wonder how did I not realize I had this all along. So going home, waiting for someone to call me was the most brutal time of my life. Um, and then I got... A biopsy and they asked me if I wanted to do surgery or if I just wanted to leave the tumor there um, I decided to get it out just because I thought that was my way of like I'm free from it and of course they did talk to me about removing it sometimes it could just like like pulling it out it could just have like all these little roots that just explode and you can have many little tumors and so I still took the chance Luckily, it wasn't anything bad. Um, I did have to get mammograms constantly back then. And then I started being stubborn and I hated mammograms. But it's very important for please, 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 ladies, to go check yourself. Please, please. This is already going to be a long video. This is a Dollar Tree haul. But for the month of October, I have my notes here, okay? For the month of October, I have two giveaways in this um, for this month. And in order for you to qualify to win, you must donate at least a dollar to the GoFundMe page to help out this, you know, this cost. And the uh, link will be in my description box below. Every other detail, I'm just going to give you a little bit of what I'm doing, but everything, all the details will be on the description box below. So please go check that out and it will be more in details for you to understand. And if you have any questions, hopefully they can be answered there. If not, you can always comment or email me. I will also leave the email down below. Okay, so you have to at least donate a dollar to the GoFundMe link below in the description box below. You must be obviously subscribed to my channel to be entered to the giveaways. You have to like this video. And if you can like every other video that i put up um comment on any or all my videos for this month of october with hashtag beat cancer and that will give you more and better chances of winning so yeah so make sure that you please share this with your friends and your family not to help out me not to help out my channel but to really help this cost out I think that's how you call it. I don't know. I should have maybe looked it up a little bit more, guys. But, you know, I'm a hot mess express, so I bring it to you how I see things. But I know you understand me. I just want to be able to help out, to do a good deed. And so if you guys can help me, that would be amazing. The money will all go to this link that I'm sharing on the bottom. It's not going to me. And so the first giveaway. The first giveaway will be this... Um, I have a brand new Apple Watch. 
Okay, and these are the bands that will be going to the watch. And then again, the details will be on the description box to let you know more about the giveaway. And then the second one, the second, I'm trying to get everything because it's on my lap and I don't want things to fall. The second giveaway will be a gift card. Um, I will put a gift card in there and then I will add this Fight Cancer Stainless Steel Bottle. It holds 26 ounces. And then, of course, I will give you the six-piece bracelet. I will also give you a little hair scarf neck, whichever way you want to use it, or wrap it around your purse. And then I will give you an eight-pack of the pink um, breast cancer awareness pen. Again, I will add a gift card, and I'm sure I'll add other stuff as I go along. But I just wanted to show you that I have two giveaways going on for the month of October and all the details so please check all the details in the box description box below so that way you understand it a little bit more and check out the link and if my sisters watch this video and you want to um help me out with um either sharing the link or mentioning this channel to so they can come this way and if they want to participate they can check out the link as well again this is not for me to grow my channel this is just for me to do something that will help out many many ladies out there so um yeah if my sisters want to help or even if you ladies want to help out and donate a dollar again this is going for a good cause okay so i just wanted to share that with you guys and i'm already at six minutes and i have a long long dollar tree haul to share with you guys so let's get started i try to put it in order so let's see where i can start i'm gonna start with halloween and i'm gonna try not to stay with the item too long or talk about it too too much because some things i already hauled and i just don't want this video to be super long and then i can't upload it and it's very important for me to upload this video that's why i even put on my pink i wanted to do stuff in my hair but i came out of work and i was super tired my husband was like um you have to do the video remember and i forgot so i bought these before and these are just for me and the boys to color for halloween just so we can do something as a family and then i saw this thankful and blessed and i thought how cute would this be just to have all year round like on my hutch or hanging on one of my doors or you know i want it i probably spray 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 paint it either black white i don't know and do something here but I thought how super cute is that just to have it all year. And I finally, finally found the table lace runner. Oh my God, these are super cute. I want it for my upstairs TV stand because that's where I'm going to decorate with Noah. But how cute. You can just put these on your table, whatever, all year round. Like super nice if you have stuff that matches with black and you like lace like I do, why not? And then I put come in for a spell or two. Did I say I come in? I don't know what I said, guys. I got this little sign here. I don't know where I'm going to put this. Maybe somewhere upstairs or outside door. I don't know. Then I finally found the ladies' tights. Um, They look like this. I probably just wear one for Halloween or something. If I go out to eat with my husband or something, just to, I don't know, try to be a little festive or something, guys. I really don't do none of that, but... And then I grabbed some of these to put like in a little bowl or something because it says glow in the dark. And I thought how cute to put them in a jar when the lights are off upstairs. You can just see like little creepy crawly hands. All right, that's it for Halloween or whatever that was. And then now we're going to jump into stuff that I got for the kids. And saying kids, meaning also Charlie, I got him a little super dog costume which i think charlie's chunky self is not gonna fit into this i got him a size large but he's getting groomed tomorrow well when you see this video he's gonna be already groomed so i'm hoping that once all the hair is gone then he will fit into this and he will look super cute and if he does i will take a picture and put it on instagram okay all right and then i found these oh my god i thought these were super cute i'm gonna share these with some of my beautiful girls that i love very much so these are the late <laughs> Lambo 
rainbow corns 3d stickers and obviously we've been seeing like notebooks and folders and all kind of goodies and look how cute they are they all pretty much look like they're unicorns sparkle on fabulous i think i know who i'm gonna send that to and when she sees this video she's gonna know i'm sending it to her and then i got i got this one the panda and then I got this one here. How cute are these, right? No Drama Llama. I just love these. I had to get them. I grabbed each and every one of them. And these are the things you can do with them. I was going to do pink nails, guys. But I came home from work super tired and I started cooking and stuff. I was like, I ain't got no time for nails. But I wanted to do pink nails. I wanted to like be very... For the month of October, I'm going to do a lot of stuff in pink. And then Monster Family for Mr. Noah to watch with his Nana. How cool is that? I think I've seen this movie before. Son of Bigfoot, because Noah is forever talking about Bigfoot lately. So I don't know what it is with him and Bigfoot, but I figure he will get a kick out of this to watch with me. And then <laughs> the, our neighbor said she saw a wolf in the park because I live here in Florida. She said she saw a wolf in the park and for us to stop walking at night. And Noah is always coming outside and tells me, can we go outside? Can we walk? Or is the wolfy outside? So I saw 100% wolf and I thought, how cute is this for Noah and I to watch? So yeah. I was super excited. When I find movies, I grab them. Movies that I think him and I are going to enjoy, I grab them. And then my daughter um, got her new place in Chicago. And it's super nice and big. And I thought that the kids might want it. Oh, this one's a little ruined. I got to fix it. So for Christmas, when I send them little packages, I want to send this one to my granddaughter. You are la -maz la amazing. Like llama, llama amazing. Whatever, guys. You know what I'm trying to say. And I don't want my grandson to feel left out. So I was looking and looking and I found this one. Roar, roar means I love you in dinosaur. So they can hang on their door. And I was like, yeah. And then I grabbed two of these, one for me and one for my granddaughter because I was on the hunt for these bad boys. And I finally found them at one Dollar Tree. Still haven't been able to see them anywhere else. And I grabbed one for her, one for myself. I grabbed one of this, one of these for her as well. And I told my grandson there's really no boy ones, but he said he'll take the pineapple that he don't care. So I got him a little tiger one, but I think it's in my another haul that I'm going to do. I found him a tiger one the day after or two days after. And I think I'm just going to throw that one in this one. So she has two. He has two. You know. Because I just like to make things even. I don't like my grandkids to feel like I love one more than the other one. Never by intention. Because I love them all so much. And I like to do amazing things for them. Anything I can do for them. All right. Beauty is kind of big, guys. Okay. Let me jump into this real quick. So Dollar Tree has all things baking now. Okay. Okay, I'm not really into baking like that, but Dollar Tree is about to make me. So I found these cake boards. And sometimes when you make a cake at home, you don't have something like to put it where you want to cut it. And so I thought, how nice is this for me to just keep at home? So when I need it, my daughter usually likes baking. Or even if we just want to do like um, put cookies and cupcakes, you just want to lay them there. And then I got the cake board in the more of the circle round. So, but Dollar Tree is doing it, guys, for this cake stuff. Then I got disposable icing, icing bags. You get 12 in there. And I thought, how fun would this be if I ever want to get creative with baking and stuff like that with Mr. Noah? Because Noah is down for anything. And then we got the cake decorating tip set. You get a shell, petal, round, weave, star, and ruffle. I'm talking a little too fast. I'm getting out of breath, guys. Then I got the icing comb set in the three-piece. How cool are these? How freaking cool. I was like, oh my God, Dollar Tree is doing it. And this is a Dollar Tree brand, so I'm hoping that every Dollar Tree brings them. And a cake spatula. I always need one of these. I never have one. They had two different ones. I only grabbed this one. And then I also grabbed the cake decorating tool set. You get three. I don't know what I'm going to do with all this, guys, but I'm going to save it because if, we, if I ever plan to do like a little cake or something for my family and I want to get bougie and make it cute, why not, right? I'm going to save <laughs> I'm going to save that bag. All right, so I win Buffalo Check, Gingham, whatever Buffalo Check. These are bigger. 
from my understanding. But I grabbed, I grabbed the, I'm trying to, um, because I just remember, I'm like, where do I remember someone saying that buffalo check and gingham is according to the size of the, the, the checkers or something? I think it was Jackie's vlogs or something. I think it was her who said that because she said, I'm a little confused to it too, but if I remember correctly, and I remember her saying that, so I think that's where I got it from, where I learned the difference. <laughs> All right, so family is everything. I got four of these. Did I get just four? Looks like I got a little bit too many. No, I got four. So, like, if my dad ever decides to come and visit or whatever, family is everything. I just thought these would be cute to put on my table so when he comes or whatever, you know, so he can put, like, his cute little plate. I don't know. Make him feel special. Like, he's, you know, my nice house guest, and I just want everything nice. I got two trays that I'm going to send to Bestie. Cause I don't think she's found them. I got them for myself, but I'm like, I'm not, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. She can have them. And then I've been buying these lately for my dishes and they had them in the buffalo check. So I was like, yes, ma'am for Christmas. This, these are the ones that are coming out. Okay. So I got two because I need two. They're small. You need two. Then I grabbed the happy fall and I like that they did both sides. Because I think I'm going to get rid of a lot of my mugs. And I'm just going to try to keep everything like very simple black and white. So I think that's what I'm going to do. And blessed. I picked up blessed. Because that's how your girl feels every day that she wakes up. Blessed. And I like things to remind me of how blessed I am. And the last two things that I grabbed from this line. This new dish line. It's the Happy Fall, and I thought how cute would this be in a little easel or something on my kitchen. And then I grabbed, of course, the one and only Blessed. So I got the cups and the plates to go with it. Even if I just want to give my daddy, my daddy some coffee. Like here, daddy. So yeah. I'm sorry that I'm bending, guys, but I have stuff everywhere. And I'm trying to hurry up because I don't want this video to be super long. Then I grabbed one more, the little cinnamon, um, little brooms because I love the way they smell. My daughter hates it, but I love it. All right. So, on this, the only thing that I'm giving away now, when you watch this video, I will do within 24 hours. Let's just put it this way. Whenever you watch this video, this is the only giveaway that I'm having. And the rest that has to do with the breast cancer awareness will be, all the details, again, will be in the description box. Okay, so that has nothing to do with this right now. <laughs> but I found these. I don't have a Cricut, but I know a lot of people have not been able to find these. And I just wanted to help you guys. So I found these three. And these are going to be on, these are going to be, the giveaway so when you watch this video which is probably october 1st october 2nd at 6 p.m i will announce the winner for these okay so i grabbed this one again gingham buffalo check vinyl paper permanent buffalo plaid maybe if i read right and then leopard and then the buffalo plaid again in the black and red so i got the black and red the leopard and the black and white and then if you are interested in this, which I will pick a winner, October 2nd, 6 p.m. Sometimes I, I drag, guys. I'm sorry. The latest will be October 3rd or 4th because sometimes I forget. You can put hashtag vinyl if you're interested in winning these. And whoever wins these, I will send them out really quick. Okay? All right. And then I try to separate everything and have things in order for you guys. So... Let's see. So I found this cute buffalo, whatever, gingham, I don't know, bowl right here for Christmas. Well, I grabbed it for Christmas. I thought how cute in like a brown paper um, bag or something. Not a bag, wrapping paper. And then put this bowl and then like a cute little like twine or something for my husband's, one of my husband's gift. And then I grabbed some of these, the 10 piece led wire lights that come like this in this greenery because i'm going to send it in happy mail and i grab 
this one i'll leave the lights and the red ribbon looks like that on the bottom i wish it would look this yellowish the light i hate when the light looks bluish it's not my thing guys i really don't like that then i grabbed some of these for my bestie because she wanted some so i got her the merry and bright and then i got her the have a joyful merry christmas you can't see that you can see my ring light and then i got her the most wonderful time of the year and then i got her another merry and bright truck and guys remember i said i was doing a christmas basket and all spongebob for my granddaughter lord and behold i went in there and i only saw this one just laying there spongebob ornament i was like what what is dollar tree doing but i am not complaining because i can put this in her package or like tie it really cute in a ribbon hanging from her gift bag oh my god lord jesus thank you but then i went to other dollar trees and i have like peppa pig and i'm not very good in the cartoons but paw patrol or something but i have not been able to find any more spongebob but i'm glad i found one and then I uh, found some mini trees. These are going in, um, hmm, in Happy Mail. And these are going in Happy Mail. I found these and I was like, what? I found some bigger ones. But these are going in Happy Mail because I believe she asked me for larger ones and I sent her ones that are a little shorter. So these are going out to her because I think she uses them to make gnomes or something. And I grabbed these ornaments and the little deer, right? <laughs> to hang them in like happy mail when I send a package or something, put a little ribbon on them and just tie them in the little package like to make it look cute for Christmas or my giveaways for Christmas. You all know what I did last year if you were with me. And if you didn't, I gave, I did the 12 day of Christmas giveaways. This year, I don't know if I'm gonna do like the whole 12 days guys because I love you all but buying this stuff is not as bad but the shipping guys the shipping was a killer <laughs> maybe i should just do gift cards or something and then i found uh, but i'm still doing giveaways i don't care i'm still doing giveaways because i am very thankful for you guys and i'm I always try to show you love no matter which way i can um i found these oh my god these are so freaking cute christmas with the nomies oh my god i was in love i was in love and I grabbed three of these. Oh my God, look how freaking adorable. I don't know if, I'm not very, very to color these. I don't want to mess them up. So who knows? I might just walk around my little Novi bag looking like that, honey. And the last thing in this bag, another wish list item. I was like, what is Dollar Tree doing to us? Check these out, guys. One is going to Happy Mail and then I grabbed two for myself. I grabbed the Merry Christmas and the Farm Fresh Christmas tree. And I'm just going to wrap these around my plants because I don't have small trees like this. So I'm going to put them on my plants so they look festive and I don't have to be moving them out of the area because I hate doing that. I'm, not, I'm like, I don't know where to put you guys. My husband, my husband, my son has been working. I'm so proud of that kid. And um, he is now cashing a check until I get him a debit card to put his money in his account and he asked me he's like i don't know where to put my coins so i said i i got you honey i got you i said I'm a, he goes can you give me a jar i was like sure so i got him shiching and the little dollar sign so he can put all his coins and save them and when that thing is full we can go to the bank and he can deposit that as well or cash it or whatever all right my last bag because oh my god we're at 23 minutes and this is beauty and it's a lot it's a lot honey yes honey it is i found these for my granddaughter how cute are these cute rainbowy stuff like she likes it i thought these were super cute for fall for me to wear on this little bun that i have going on here okay look how cute these are these colors are amazing i found new glue nail i don't know how good it is but i like to put a little drop of this and a drop of my other one this is by the onyx professional which i think dollar tree is just changing packages on us i think that's how they're getting us they're very smart well this is not by green barter no 
Onyx brand. And then I found these cute headbands. Look how cute this is. I love it. And then I got myself this one too. Because I think this is super cute for the holidays and stuff. To do your hair. And look pretty. And oh my god guys. I have a big mirror that I carry everywhere. I'll do my eyebrows and stuff like that. But how nice it is to have one that you could just grab. And you can also like put it on the wall. Simply flip stand to hang onto wall. Or just have a little stand and put it on your table. And you don't have to. You see it shows you how you can do it here. Or on top of a table. And how nice is this for a dollar? You can always throw these in like Christmas baskets. I was going to say stockings. But it's a little big for stockings. But you know what I mean. Like little add-on gifts. That's what I'm trying to say. To the bigger gift. And then I finally found the Travel Blender's travel case and the strawberry they had the i was gonna get them all they had pineapple and they had um a pear and i was like i'm gonna grab them all i'm like girl slow your row you got one blender like why you have to take everything <laughs> but i grabbed one so i grabbed the strawberry and oh my god guys i love these and these you don't find them at dollar tree anymore like you used to but i found these and they're going in, one is for me and the rest are going for, to Happy, I'm putting them in Happy Mail. But they haven't seen these at Dollar Tree in a hot minute. I do find them at Dollar General and at Family Dollar. But I wasn't finding them at Dollar Tree anymore. And these are the LA Colors Watermelon Splash Slant Tip Applicator. I was like, yes ma'am. Yep, and then I'm going to try this for my face because my facial wash, I, wa I, I use Tula, whatever it's called, that blue bottle. It's like a teal blue. I use all the cleaning, all the stuff for my face on that brand, but it's expensive. So I'm running out of face wash, so I wanted to try the Watermelon Daily Cleanser Hydrate Skin with Watermelon Extract. Leave skin hydrated and fresh, paraben free, and it's 6.4 ounces. And it smells like watermelon. I hate when it says watermelon and it doesn't smell like watermelon. And I'm trying to see if this is by. It's not by Green Barrier, so. And it says extra care. Oh my God, guys. Celebration. I just discovered Celebration here in Florida has a street that is called Green Briar. And if I remember, I'm going to post the Green Briar street. Okay. I was like, what? I need a picture of that. I got myself some scrunchies. I grabbed this one here because I love the thickness and the black. And since my hair after COVID, if my hair was, it's, it fell a lot. I have this little thing. My bun used to be this big. Now I got this little thing. And I need tiny little scrunchies that's going to hold my hair because these things, they fall out. If I do a ponytail, they fall out of my hair. But I think they're still cute. And I grabbed um 20 piece styling because i thought the colors were perfect for fall how beautiful is that and i grabbed I'm trying to see if i'm done with all the scrunchies all right i found some elf stuff and my daughter loves these stuff these things so i think i'm going to save them for her stocking i bought her the detoxifying bubble mask by elf and then I got her, I got one for my son. And then I got her lemon infused brightening mask, like a halo for your face. Like a halo. Hollow. Like a halo, girl. Learn how to read for your face. This sheet mask brightens the skin for a radiant looking complexion. And then this one says, reset your skin, no juice cleanse necessary. The bubbling sheet mask is toxifying for a clear looking I don't know, guys. I think I'm going to try this one, and I'm going to give these to my kids because they love anything charcoal and all that good jazz. And then I found... Oh, I got another clip, guys. I forgot to show you this one. How cute is that? Like, date night with hubby. For my cute photos. Well, I don't know if you guys think they're cute, but for my photo shoots. And this is Beauty Collection Makeup Removal Towels. Towels. So I want to try that on my face. And I grabbed pink with polka dots because, hello, I love pink and polka dots. And I got this one because they're a little bigger. Or I might throw those in a giveaway. I'm not sure yet, guys. All right. 
I try to separate everything, but this is hard, guys. This is hard for me to do it. And I grabbed, well, my daughter grabbed these Dia de los Muertos 3D Lashes. Wispy Spiky. So she grabbed that. I think I tilt you guys there. I don't know what I did. And they have beauty blenders, guys. They have beauty blenders. I don't know if they're any good. Well, we're going to see if they are. And it doesn't say they're by Greenbrier. So I grabbed this color. Latex free. I grabbed that color. It's like a purpley and white. And then I grabbed this cute blush pink, like with yellow. How cute is that? And I found this e.l.f. brush I'm going to put in my daughter's um, Christmas basket. Because like when she wants to do her highlight and stuff like that. And then I found this Lonely Lonely China Glaze Crackle Nail Polish. And I just love the sparkling, the golden brown. So I grabbed that. It was the only one I found. Then I found the Active Workout Ready Hydration Stick. I might give this to my stepdaughter. I'm not sure. I don't know. I grabbed one. And I know my bestie's going to send me one of these. So I grabbed one for my daughter. The e.l.f. Dream On Lip Gloss. I'm going to put this in her gift basket. Oh, everything's falling, guys. I grabbed this one for myself because it said matte lip color wine. I thought it was brown. I was hoping it was this color, but it says wine. So I don't know if I'm even going to use it for myself or put it in a giveaway. And I, gra oh, I grabbed the blue one too because my daughter likes that weird stuff. So I grabbed that one too for her Christmas stocking. I also grabbed her some lashes from e.l.f. And I also grabbed her the e.l.f. Cover Everything Concealer because she loves the banana powder. So I'm assuming she might like this one to put in her stocking. And I got for myself the Stardust Glitter when I do my makeup for my Friday little photo shoots when I get to do them. How nice would that be? And then... Um, I grabbed another one to put in my daughter because this color I thought it was dark for me and it's actually I will need a shade darker. It looks dark in the bottle, but it's really not. This is by the color sand. I don't know if I can show you guys. Focus, focus. Anyways, by the color sand elf. So it was a little light for me. Like I needed a shade darker, but I think it'll go great for my daughter. So I grabbed another one to put in her stocking. And I found this Pure Silk Spot Therapy Razor. And I believe it has a six double flex head. Dollar Tree has never done this. Never. They, are, they never come like this. And it's nice and well packaged. And it feels, the handle's really nice and thick. Usually they have like the one blade or something in a three pack or whatever. I don't know. Two pack. I don't remember how many come in a pack. But these are individual and they have a little coupon in there if you want to use. So I figure my daughter loves these four or five blades. I'm going to put this one in her stocking and hopefully she likes it. So you got to start early, guys. And I got myself some NYX NYX lipstick, whatever you want to call that. Everybody says something different. And I'm going to swatch them for you even though I've been here for a long time. This one is the Sewell, I don't know, NYX NYX Professional. Let's swipe it, guys. I really want to try like a nice purple lipstick. And it's a matte lip cream, so I'm hoping it's not super dry. I'm trying to see if it focuses on the color. Well, let's see. Oh, it has another wrapping. And I hate using my teeth when you guys are watching me on camera. But I want to show you guys because that way you guys know if it's pretty or not. If you want to do it, if you want to get it. If you don't want to get it this is horrible you guys are like oh disgusting <laughs> all right 
Oh my God, yes. Yes, yes, yes. How beautiful that is. Oh, I love that color. I can't wait. It's a little, I don't know. It feels creamy, but at the same time, like it's a little dry. And then I got San Juan because hello. I know I think Mexico has San Juan too, but Puerto Rico has San Juan. And it's one of my favorite places in Puerto Rico. It's like nice and cute and bougie or whatever. And yeah, if I could ever live in Puerto Rico, that would be the spot I want to go to. Or Cabo Rojo, if you guys are familiar with this area. Oh my goodness. Oh my God, guys. I really don't want to be... Oh, I can just... I'll deal with it later. <gasps> yes, this is nice for the summer when you have a nice tan. Honey. These are my colors. I love it. And then this one is in the Buenos Aires. It's a little lighter. But I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. I think this is my last bag, right? Did I show you guys everything already? Wowzers. And it looks like this. Yeah, they're a little like clumpy. Like, that's probably why they're a Dollar Tree. Like, you really have to like... See, guys, look. You see that? See that right there? That's probably why they're a Dollar Tree. Like, you really need to mess with these. Blend them in really nice. But that's the color. All right. Let me make sure I show you guys everything. Maybe it's not so long as I thought it was going to be. I thought, I'm like, oh my God, this video is going to take like two hours. All right, guys. So that is it for this Dollar Tree haul. And don't forget to please check out the description box below so you can read all the details that you need to know about the month of October breast cancer awareness and my giveaways. And yeah. And if any of my YouTube sisters want to share this, my channel to let them know about the link, or maybe you want to add the link to your description box as well. And again, this is just for a good cause. This is not about me. It's just about helping and doing a good deed. Anyways, guys, that is it for now. Thank you so much. Don't forget that I love you. I love you so, so much. And I'll catch you guys on my next one. Have a good night. Be kind. And I'll see you soon.